Yo, what is up, guys? I'm Wesam here. Uh, this is my first video in my YouTube channel. I hope you enjoy this video. Uh, in this video, I wanna talk to you about uh, Simu's music player. Uh, this is a very fantastic music player. You can uh, see how to download and install it uh, in this website, simu's.github.io. Uh, uh, normally you can uh, install it uh, on Linux uh, on Linux using uh, your package manager and uh, you can also install this on Mac uh, okay uh, when you first uh, start uh, the app uh, first of all you you see nothing because uh, you should add your uh, music uh, to uh, to your uh, player and basically uh, the key map of uh, this app is like uh, Vim and uh, you can uh, place column uh, and type your commands uh, so your first command would be uh, the add command to add your music uh, for example my music is uh, placed here when I uh, type this uh, my music will be added here and uh, if uh, the list will be empty uh, you can see uh, new music will be added okay uh, the way you will uh, work with uh, this app uh, is very simple uh, you can uh, press the number keys in your keyboard one two three four five and uh, when you press these keyboards uh, when you press these numbers uh, you will see the layout will be changed the first layout when you press uh, one uh, uh, will be look like this you can see artists or albums here and uh, when you press tab uh, you can see uh, the cursor will be switch back to the tracks and you can uh, find your music and when you place uh, when you press enter uh, you can uh, play music uh, when you press 2 number 2 uh, you have the library view uh, here you have all of your musics here and uh, you can see them and uh, play them so there is no nested directory here all of your music in one place uh, and when you press 3 you can see your playlists basically you can create uh, as many playlists as you want and uh, you can play them uh, from here but I will not go through it uh, in this video because uh, uh, we don't have time to uh, and when you press number four uh, you will see your play queue I will show you how it works and uh, when you press number five you can browse your file system and uh, find the music where it is and play it from here uh, and when you uh, press number six you can see filters i will uh, talk to you about this and number seven is for uh, settings okay uh, i will show you how you can work with it uh, so i press number one to switch back to play uh, artist and album mode uh, with arrow keys you can go up and down uh, and when you press tab uh, you can switch between uh, the left side panel to the right side panel uh, you can see I press tab and it goes uh, between them uh, to play music you can uh, press enter when you press enter uh, you can see uh, how it will be highlighted uh, for seeking uh, through music uh, you can press right or left for example when you can uh, press right uh, you can see here the time uh, is shifting forward I disabled the sound you can hear the sound uh, so there will be no uh, corporate issues with the movie uh, as you can see the number here is uh, going the music is playing when I 
press right arrow you can see the music is going forward and when I press uh, left arrow uh, the music is uh, going backward uh, also you can uh, use uh, HJKL keys to uh, go left and right you can see when I press H it goes backward and when I, when I press L it goes forward for Vim users uh, this is uh, this will look looks familiar uh, and when you can uh, when you press K uh, you can see it goes up and when you press J it goes down exactly like them uh, okay uh, you can press X to play music from start you can see here when I press X it will be uh, play music from start I, I will press X and it will be uh, roll back and play music again uh, when you press C it will pause you can see how it will change to this and when you press it again it will be uh, resume the music but uh, here if you uh, press C uh, it will pause but if you press X it will resume uh, so X here uh, when when your music is paused when you press X it will be resumed but uh, when you press X here twice after uh, when when the music is playing when you press X it will be goes back and uh, play the music from the start okay uh, so if you want to change to next or uh, previous music you can uh, press Z to go to previous and uh, press B to go to next but uh, here you have some options uh, to take care of if you press S uh, you can see uh, this S will be go and if you press it again it will uh, be show this S means shuffle you can use it to uh, play music randomly okay uh, if you, you you can see here uh, I'm playing this and if I press B it will be go to next music uh, like that you can see this is going down if you press Z it will go back like that and uh, this kind of next and previous but uh, if you press S and this option is uh, enabled when you press B it goes another way you can here uh, goes here and when you press Z uh, it goes back in other place and that's random you know uh, this is uh, this is shuffling uh, stuff and uh, this will be very useful when you want to listen to music randomly but when you uh, press B for example and it goes here and there when, uh, when you find when you want to find uh, the music what music is playing you can see here uh, it will show the details you can simply play I and uh, it will be navigated to the music and you can uh, see how uh, it plays and uh, one one other option is uh, how how you can search music and this is uh, again exactly like Vim you can press uh, forward slash and type your uh, search term and then you can press enter and press N to go to a next match you can see uh, it's how it goes to next match and if you want to go back to previous you can press shift and n and it, it goes back to uh, to previous search and when you press enter it will be uh, play music uh, where you can where you searching it and this is basically uh, the basic features of uh, this app uh, but the feature are more uh, so now let's talk about this kind of stuff here uh, here in library you, you can see all of your music uh, one one thing that uh, would be helpful here is uh, you can search and filter your music here for example uh, you can press shift and F and it will be type the filter term for you and you can uh, you can
type some uh, search cr criteria here for example uh, there is a play count uh, option here and you can filter any music for example the play count is equals to zero and uh, you can see the music is uh, filtered or uh, for example uh, you can find uh, the music with play count more than two and you can see uh, there is some music and uh, these filters are very helpful and if you want to remove the filter simply uh, place an empty filter and it will be goes on uh, the playlist is something else we don't want to talk about it here the play queue is uh, very handy you can find your uh, music and you want to play some music uh, in a queue uh, and listen to them you can press E when, when you uh, on a music and it's highlight like here uh, instead of pressing enter you can press E and uh, notice how uh, the cursor will be um, goes down to the blow item and uh, it means the item is placed on the queue if you press 4 you can see uh, it's placed here and uh, I will press uh, 1 to go back here press E you can see it goes down press E and we have three items here so if you press uh, X for example to continue music and press B the next music is playing here and if I press B again you can see the next music and B the next music is uh, played here this play queue track and uh, this play queue uh, mode is very helpful and you can uh, add as many as songs here if you want and you can see the songs will be goes here and press delete to remove them uh, when you press number five uh, you can browse your music and press enter to play it like a normal music and six here uh, is your filters uh, you can merge some filters uh, with each others and uh, apply them uh, using the filter term uh, for example here is an unheard filter which is uh, placed here by, by default uh, if you remember uh, I typed it here like this uh, but I can simply uh, type unheard and that will be do the same for me okay and uh, you can add new filters here and when you press 7 you go to settings and you can here you can see all of key bindings here and uh, you can customize them and uh, change the colors and other options and things like that and that's it uh, it was my first video on youtube uh, on my youtube channel please hit the subscribe button and uh, smash that uh, like button to help me uh, to grow up my channel thank you in advance wish you all the best peace out